Hi guys, so this is our video for today and this is a inspired look by no other than Jacqueline Hill as you see in the title. So let's get started. Um, first we're going to apply this red tone brown and I'm using the 35 O matte palette. Um, and I'm putting this color in my crease and a little bit above my crease. I'm going to apply this brownish, this light brownish orange and I'm going to add this as a transition transition color mm -hmm. and it, it's going to bring a little bit more blendability to the color that we placed earlier. So this orange we're going to place below that transition color. We're just going to deepen that red this color that we placed earlier and bring it bring a little bit more orange into the look. I really started to love these transition colors because it brings more warmth in for melanin skin. But anyway, let's get back to the look. Here I'm applying the City Color Matifying Balm as my primer for the color on the Nouveau lid. I'm applying the color on the mobile lid and I'm applying a bronzy shade to the mobile lid and this is from my stacked palette it's from T-Mart I had it years ago but yeah this is the color that we're applying on the mobile lid And just because I love to, I'm going to darken the outer corner of my eyes and I'm using this dark brown from the 35O matte palette also and I'm just going to apply it and kind of blend it out into that brick transition shade that we added earlier. We're not stopping there, we're going to darken this look a little bit more with a little bit of black and we're going to like Alright, so you know we have to set the brow bone. Even though I kind of did when I applied my primer, I set my primer before doing this look, but I'm just going to intensify that brow bone. And I'm using this light brown 
sampai satu pada proses. And of course, it wouldn't be a more lovely look if it doesn't have a little bit of wind because I love a wing on my eyes. So I'm just going to wing out this look and we're just about to the eyes. Comment down below if you love a good liner. I'm in love with liner. Like, a good liner, green liner, to do wing, to do wing liner. And let's take a pull right up there. Let wing liner or no wing liner. Let's see which one. Is. Let's see if I'm the only one that loves wing liner. So you guys see that bomb wing? Yeah, I have to. Alright, so we're going to put a few other shades from the 35 Oak palette on the lower lash line just to kind of harmonize the look and to make it look complete. We're going to apply those shades and then we're going to apply a little bit of line in the bottom line. Alright, so that's the highlight that we'll be using and it's from my hand and you guys see how gorgeous that looks. Let's look at it again. Look how beautiful it is. Right, so this is the brush that we'll be taking and it's from my back palette and it's a beautiful orange blush and it goes well I put this look. Alright, so I had applied lashes and the video of this will be on my Instagram. And yeah, I applied mascara, my long mascara, mascara to my top and the bottom lashes. So sample the lips, but let's look at that look. Isn't it gorgeous? Isn't it gorgeous? So this look, I tried two lip colors. Kind of a burnt brick red. It's not this look, but I just had to see what another lip color would look like. in every step, give me a sign, hitting the mark, take to the sky, chasing the stars, open your eyes, watching afar, waiting to fly. This is the start. Yes, isn't this look just gorgeous? Like, take Hey guys, so this video is a inspired look. This is the look. It is inspired by Jacqueline Hill. She is a big YouTuber. So from you watching me, you must you must be watching her. She's a big YouTuber. She is so dumb to earth and I love her. I watch her on the snap. I watch her videos like I binge watch her videos. 
and yeah i really love her she's she's she has a personality kind of like me she was kind of dark and then she but she if you get to know her she is like fun loving and real and down to earth and yeah but on top of it you might see if you don't know her you might see a standoffish kind of girl that that's kind of like me so i kind of relate to her a little relate to her she's like my spirit animal low key <laughs> anyways but yeah this is the look it's inspired by her because she loves to do these um warm looks she's known for these warm red tone looks i'm not normally a red tone kind of girl i'm more warm um cool i should say i might i more do the um bluish undertone kind of looks but i decided that i want to try this and you guys can see i'm sweating the fan is not on i'm done but let me just end this video so yeah um no so yeah that that is the look that i did this video i hope you guys enjoy the video it's the look um i hope you guys enjoy um yeah i'm hella so team um but yeah this is moya lovely signing out and remember to wear the best you for the world to see bye dolls remember to like comment and subscribe